Hello YouTube, Sam here from youtube.com slash onlivegamer from the new Boston. And in this tutorial, we're going to create a class library based on our favorites.vb, webfavorite.vb, and webfavorite collection. Now before we get started, I just want to give full credit to the writers of Beginning Microsoft Visual Basic 2008. Um, they did a great job of making this program. Uh, it is written by Kieran Willis and Brian Newsom. So let's go ahead and get started. So what we need to do to create a class library is we'll come over here to file and we need to add a new project. So we're going to select a class library and we'll just name it Internet Favorites. And then we'll go ahead and click OK. So you can see here over in our Solution Explorer we have favorites viewer YouTube and then we have our internet favorites class library so let's just go ahead and right click on this and set it as the startup project now here you can see it generated a class 1.vb for us and we're going to be getting rid of, rid of that um, soon so we'll take web favorite collection we'll right click it and we'll copy it and we'll just come down here and we need to paste it under internet favorites so we'll select paste. Now you can't see that, but if you right click, there will be an option to paste it. So now that we have one in there, let's go ahead and delete class1.vb. So now we have web favorite web favorite collection.vb. So we'll copy over web favorite. So copy it. Select internet favorites and then paste it. And now we'll copy favorites. So copy favorites, select internet favorites and then just go ahead and paste it. Okay, so now we've pasted favorites.vb, webfavorite.vb, and web favorite collection down in our Internet Favorites class library project. So we'll right click on Internet Favorites and we will click Build. So it's going to run through the process and let's see here. We have an error. Message box is not declared. Um, so what we need to do is we need to use an import statement. So let's find out where this is. We'll double click on this error. And you can see here that it is in the favorites class. So what we need to do is we need to import windows dot or system dot windows or let's see. So it looks like that we cannot import system.windows.forms. So what we need to do is select Internet Favorites. We will come up here to Project and we will add a reference. So we'll go to .NET and we'll find system.windows.forms. We'll go ahead and click OK. And now, if we go ahead and use imports system dot windows dot forms, it will let us use our message box dot show. Now let's find the other occurrence of this error. So we'll need to import system dot windows dot forms. So in order for us to use a message box in a class library, we're going to have to import. We're going to have to reference a DL a DLL for system dot windows dot forms and we'll have to import it. So now we'll go ahead and try to build it again. And you can see that it says build succeeded. So let's go into our internet favorites. We'll go to bin and then release. And you can see here is our internet favorites dot DLL. Now yours will probably have a different icon uh, because my icon is set to open with IL, IL spy. So here's our internet favorites DLL and we can use this um, in creating new applications now whenever we want to be able to access our internet favorites and get the names and the URLs and store them in a collection.